the thing that's been lovely is that in my life, like there's a lot of play for, for example, the uh, Us Festival, you know, per- footage from 1983. I had a good day. And I had a good day because we would only had to do a, a one hour show less, maybe a 50 minute show the night before in uh, uh, Florida, o- opening on a ZZ Top outdoor thing. We flew over to California and then we only had to do like a 60 minute show there. And so it was like, hey, this won't be so hard. Uh, you just mentioned OzFest there. I've got to ask you about that as well. I mean, um, some incredible bands are on that day along with you. On it was it Van Halen and Motley Crue and Priest, I think, and, and various others as well. I mean, what are your memories from that day? Well, I, I, I certainly remember being on that bill and thinking, I don't think we belong on this. Bill. Oh, no way. <laughs> you know, we were we were the we were the outlier. But well, I mean, part of it. Steve Wozniak's money it was Apple's you know Macintosh's money and uh he he we were one of his favorite bands and so he wanted us on that bill um and uh I think what the you know we proved that day that we were a pretty good band in our own way you know that we yes we weren't like you know Scorpions and Priest and uh, uh, Motley Crue and you know and Van Halen, they were a lot heavier, harder hitting than we were. Um, but we were kind of a band that was like when Triumph first started, we were a Led Zeppelin copy band playing bars, and so and Led Zeppelin was a band that kind of it, it had that sort of float like a butterfly, hammer like the gods. <laughs> <laughs> you know, a uh, uh, style of, and we were a very Led Zeppelin y kind of rock band. Um, and I liked, uh, you know, bands like Journey and Foreigner and Styx, and the, the, that there was a melodic kind of approach. So we were a bit of an outlier, but um, I enjoyed it. And I mean, uh, I think the Scorpions played after us, and to me, they sounded really good. They were tight. And uh, they had a, a really good band sound. Um, uh, but, it, yeah, you know, I didn't get to see a lot of the other bands. We kind of flew in in a helicopter, played our gig, st- hang around a little bit, and then flew back out and we were gone. But I'm going to mention this just because, you know, you're English. I'm going to – we played uh, Stoke on Trent once at uh, Heavy Metal Holocaust. And uh, we were up the bill from uh, – the, the headliner that day was uh, – uh, oh my God, Lemmy, Motorhead, and uh, but th- the other band was Ozzy, and Ozzy had Rudy, uh, Randy Rhodes, Rudy Sarzo, and and uh, oh God, uh, Tom, Tommy Aldridge, and that was one of the best rock bands I ever saw, ever in my life, and I've seen a lot of rock bands, yeah. but to, that day they had a good day. I, I, you know, I, I could take or leave Ozzy; it, it doesn't do anything for me, but. Randy Rhodes on guitar, oh my God. And like Rudy Sarzo on bass with Tommy Aldridge, that was a rhythm section. They absolutely kicked ass. Like they were so, uh, so good. So, you know, it wasn't the US Festival, but I thought I'd mention that one because yeah, you know, that's where you were going. 